actually like go around in, I guess. But still. This is the third the third house on the surface I've built. And I had a lot of hard time saying that for some reason. Alright, let's go outside. Everything should be burning up right now. Yep, they're burning up over there. Here, you're not dying fast enough, I'll help kill you. Ow! And we have chickens and roses. Let's collect the roses. You know, we can't be that far from my original base, but I don't know what direction... Hmm. Really? There's, there's a grassland biome. We didn't walk that far underground, I think. I was going to ask you if I found the cave in the first place, but it's just... Yeah, I dug down to it. Down. I think that was descriptive enough. Mm -hmm. Alright, we're going to collect this wood. Because we need more wood. Well, I'm faced with the choice between... Well, first of all, I should probably bring all that stuff up from the lower... the lower... thing. Yeah. Alright. Very pretty area we're in, and I see a cave entrance down there, don't you? Look at that. Yeah. Could be a dud. It smells like a dud, but it might not be. There's a spider over there. He's not a dead. And there's a lot Actually, of chickens around I think here. Sort of is. In a way. Look at that mountain. That's pretty. How high up are we? We're we're at 85, and that's way higher than us. So that might go up to 110. And if I'm not mistaken, doesn't that look like a ravine-type structure in the middle of the mountain? And that's even higher over there. Maybe. Hmm. Some exploration is needed, I think. Alright, first of all, I'm going to drop everything in here except just a sword and a pickaxe. I want to have enough room to carry everything. I'm going to take out the sword. Just in case we get ambushed on the way down, or up. Especially up. Uh. Oh boy, that was rude. Why did I do that? Because it was rude? Exactly. Uh, reminds me of when I was at work a few days ago. I was eating lunch in the break room. And I felt a burp coming out, so I, I let it out. I thought it was going to be like a very, you know, brief, you know, burp. But it was just loud. It was like a huge roar. And it continued. It just continued for like several seconds, just reverberating off the walls. It was. And not... How many people stared at you wondering what the heck that was? <laughs> well, I was in the break room by myself, but I was mortified because I was, I was afraid that customers. <laughs> they must have heard it because it was so loud. <laughs> it was like. It was. The, the, as loud as somebody shouting, probably. Really loud. I was both proud of myself and mortified. Huh. I'm torn between wanting to kill the chickens for food and bring them for farms. I honestly don't know. Well, I already I have eggs, don't I? I can do I can. There's a possibility I can get chickens from those. Uh, I have, no. No, I thought you did. I thought you could throw an egg and get a chicken. I honestly don't know what happens if you throw an egg. I think it, um, you can use it to knock people, you know, zombies and such off, um, ledges or something. Gotta put the front stoop in place. There we go. Alright. Now the question is, if I'm going to go exploring, what else do I need besides what I have in here? 
You got the bucket. You need the uh, bucket of water. You need a good supply of wood. You've got that. Um, maybe I'll bring my axe. Oh, got that. Yes. What do you need the axe for? To cut down more trees. Because we well, you're going to go some... exploring on the surface. Yeah, at least somewhat. Uh, right. I don't really need anything else, do I? <laughs> no, not really. I could bring some food. Except some food. Oh, get my bread. That's about it right now. I guess I'll bring the rotten flesh just because you never know. Oh, I should bring the pickaxe if I'm already using, I guess. Good idea. And I'll bring some gravel, I guess. Alright. I'm gonna go above ground exploring. So many choices to pick. Actually, I think that is in that direction. Hmm. I don't know what direction my house was in, because I know it was on the border of an epic mountains biome. Hmm. Oh no. I'm torn between wanting to kill the chickens and wanting to spare them. I just saw a hole in the ground. Yeah, let's go down there. I'm curious about that too. Uh, that's probably just an indentation. Yeah, I'm sure it's probably nothing. Ow! That hurt. Alright, so we're now on surface level. Oh, surface coal. And a big one at that. Relatively, oh, yeah. So we are going to do some coal digging. Chicken, you pushed me. That wasn't polite. You shouldn't push me. I'm bigger than you. I can push you around. I can smack you with my axe. Alright. Huh. So much coal and we haven't even gone underground at this moment. Alright. 19 goal, gold? Coal for oh. that. If you wish. Yes. Okay, there's a, there's a lot of chickens. I, I think we can spare to kill a couple. We can stand to kill a couple, I guess. Yeah. That's big food. Yes, I'll, I can make it later if I get hungry. Collect flowers. Planting flowers. Very pretty area, but we are not going that way right now. There's some promising looking openings over there. Where are my torches? Did I forget to bring my torches? It yes. doesn't, doesn't matter though because I have... Oh look, clay. Oh, right. It doesn't matter though because I have um, coal and I have wood. So... We are going to make some torches. Alright. Collecting flowers for our sweeties. Yes. Happy Valentine's Day in December. And here we are. Ooh, there's a bridge of a kid that goes down. First thing, let's take a look at the high part. Oh, definitely. The above sea level part. Get to the high ground first. Yes, it's a. If you can. Most logical course of action. <laughs> Alright. All this coal. If only I could drag this coal back to Smoothie with me. I, I must have 300 by now. All around the world. All around this world? Yeah. I, I probably have enough coal to smelt the great library. Oh, look. Look what I found. More coal. So I have pays to look up. And see what's right over your head. Oh man, it's 
exciting. Something's walking around out there. Hopefully just a chicken. Shoop. Oh boy. Derp, 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 derp. So I'm going to put you on the spot and ask you, when do you plan to make more Minecraft videos? Well, I'm thinking about that. I've got, uh, I've got like three out of four um, branches on the bands. Uh, they have something on them. I'm not quite sure what to do about the fourth one yet. I like mm -hmm. what I've done with the third one, though, because it's fancy. Oh, yeah? It's stuff out of, uh, out of blocks of iron, obsidian. I found a lot of obsidian. There's this big nice. lava pool in the, uh, down in the ravine mm -hmm. near, the, uh, near the nether sphere. Sweet. So you use that? Yeah. Took me a lot of... Took me a long time, though. Ah, look, a nice, nice little view over here. And I'm still really curious about. You want to go down that I... one part of the cave that we haven't explored yet? <laughs> yes. Hello, chickens. Getting food. How much do we have? Seven. Okay. This might be an ocean biome right here. Looks like it. Alright, well it's getting dark, so we're gonna go back underground. Wait, what's over here? Well, there's the house. There's some coal way up there. You're looking at it. You were looking at it. Alright, here we go. That's where we came in. Oh, creeper. A creeper. Another creeper. A zombie. A zombie. And another zombie. Well, they don't waste any time spawning. Nope. Underground time. <laughs> oh, would you look at that? Oh, wait. Not necessarily. Not necessarily a dud. Wait. I heard an arrow hit me. And I saw a creeper down there. I, I thought I did. I thought I saw a creeper. The arrow missed me, but I heard, I heard it go. All right. Very dangerous opening here. Spider. Where? After you, I think. Ah! Die, you spider. Okay. What's this over here? A very deep shaft. Holy moly. I wonder if that's going to eventually connect to down here. Maybe. Looks uh, like it might. Well, we're going to make a crafting table. Better make this into planks while we're here. We're going to take that. I make a furnace. Oh, and you're gonna cook the chicken. Yes. Gonna cook me some chicken. Oh yeah. Wonder if you're gonna take the furnace along with you. Maybe I should, so I won't have to keep making furnaces all the time. Oh. Ah, yummy. Too bad I didn't bring any flint because I now have arrows. Well, all you need to do is find gravel and keep digging at it until you get flint. Good point. Right, we'll stay down here for a bit. How about it's our elevation? 59. We're just slightly below sea level at this point. And the cave still goes on a bit. We'll let the chicken get cooked. Our delicious, wonderful chicken. Because everybody likes chicken. Even vegetarians like chicken, they just don't want to admit it. They're like, ooh, I smell delicious chicken. But no, can't eat. Think of the animals. 
But it smells so good. But think of the animals. <laughs> yes. That's what goes on. Probably. Possibly. Okay. You gonna leave that furnace there? Or? First one to eat my chicken. There we go. How'd you get down here, chicken? It fluttered down here, I guess. Must have. All right. Huh. Ah. Yeah. Oh I goodness. Heard that too. Creeper and a skeleton. skeleton. Now, if the skeleton shoots the creeper, the creeper's gonna blow up and kill the skeleton. Is that how that works? Yeah. This is scary. Holy crap! See? It just happened. That's awesome. Oh, my day has been made. <laughs> There's a. Yep, he's a dead. A dead skelly, alright. Yes, I, I do like how when they get hit by somebody it changes their attack. It's kind of funny because skeletons are the most harmful, you know, one of the most harmful mobs when they're after you, but when uh -huh. another mob gets sent on them, they're pretty much uh, helpless. <laughs> but <laughs> zombies will totally own a... Yeah, because, because zombies don't wait between attacks. Yes, and I don't think touching a skeleton hurts you. I think only the arrows hurt you. Whereas just touching a uh, zombie will uh, hurt you. I could be wrong, but I think that's how how it is. Right. Why is it possible to shear a chicken? <laughs> Come here, chicken. Uh, I'm gonna shear you. No. Okay, I guess not. <laughs> just had to try. Well, I guess it would be called plucking if you took the feathers off. Okay, we have... How many options do we have? We have a, apparently three. I think you gotta go with the one with... Uh, well, pick up the um, arrows at least. And all that other stuff to slodge by that creeper. Alright, well since we're already down here, I say this way we're going. We're at an elevation of what? 54. So we're below sea level and it's continuing to lower. Zombie. Prepare to die, zombie. I find if you jump around, you tend to get critical get hits. Get critical hits, yeah, I know. And we have another branching path. Never do that, though. Oh, God. Oh, Are wait. We add wait. Skeleton. Yes. Yes. I got the zombie after the skeleton. But I still got yeah, the skeleton still, after me. Still after you. What you really gotta do is, like, actually, no. You know what I gotta do? Yeah, put the zombie between you and... Get that block, yeah, oh, get him. I... Get him for me. Alright. Thank you, zombie. I, your reward will be dead. The problem with that is that you don't get credit for killing the skeleton, because the zombie did it. <laughs> Unless you don't get the experience points. Alright, multiple branching paths here. I think I'm going to explore this way first, but I'm still going to want to get yeah this, back down there. This uh, iron. Oh man. Okay, got that. It was this way, right? That's how I was going to go first. The higher one, yeah. All right. Well, we've certainly found a big enough cave system. Oh wait, it's gonna happen again. Watch. 